Hi, Todd Dunn here on February 7, 2018. Just a very short video to show you one way of connecting multiple solar panels to a charge controller without trying to jam all the wires from the different panels into the connections on the controller. What I have here is this little black thing with the screws in it is called a barrier terminal strip. And the screws on either side, this one and this one, are electrically connected. So if I connect a wire to this screw and a wire to this screw, they're electrically connected. Similarly, over here, the same. Now what I've done, though, is I have put something like, a little thing like this. This is called a jumper. And I have set this jumper between two connections like that. So that connects this connection to that one. So basically, any wire connected to any of these four screws now is in the same circuit. So what I have here is negative wires from two solar panels illustrated here and here, and a wire going to the solar charge controller. The jumper connects this wire to that one, and this one and that one are connected straight across the barrier terminal. The same thing happens for the positive. Wires from two solar panels coming in with a jumper here and the wire to the solar con charge controller. You can buy barrier terminal strips in a variety of different sizes and this one happens to be a four conductor one. You can get them up to 20 or so. Um, they also come with different size terminals. This is one I just happened to have. I didn't have any of the right size connectors to put on the wires, so all I did was jam the wires under the screws, which I would not recommend that you do. But if you had the right size connectors, you just put the connectors on the wires and put them on there. What I, and one additional thing I would do is instead of coming direct from the solar panel to the barrier terminal strip, I would have a connector of some sort, a plug, in the wire here that the solar panel plugs into so you could easily disconnect the solar panel from the system. So anyway, this just illustrates how to go about connecting multiple solar panels to one solar charge controller. The only thing you want to be careful of is make sure that your solar panels are matched. Only connect panels of the same voltage rating and ideally of the same wattage. Okay, thanks for watching. If you liked it, thumbs up and uh, please subscribe to my channel.